Hello and welcome to my tutorial. I will be teaching you how to use DHCPIG. Now DHCPIG is a DHCP exhaustion attack designed to take away all the IP addresses that a DHCP server has to offer any clients. Now I am using Backtrack 5 R3 but I have it installed in a virtual machine. I am also using the Unity feature which allows me to use my Windows host machine and just see the windows from our Backtrack virtual machine as if they were Windows 7 windows. So let's take a look at our DHCP server. We will navigate here to the setup tab and then just scroll down a bit. There is our default information for this router, and right here is our DHCP server. Now, as you can see, we have it set up so that our DHCP pool is size 20 addresses, which means this DHCP server has 20 addresses to hand out. Now, let's see how to navigate to the tool. You can, there's two ways to do it. You can either utilize the graphical user interface and navigate to the tool or you can do it via a terminal window. I'm going to show you how to do it in a terminal. So we need to change the directory to pen test stressing and then dhcpig and there we are. So if we do an ls we can see that in green is the script name and then the readme file. Now to run this script or tool, we need to use dot slash pig dot py and then the interface. And in our case, it is Ethernet zero. So now let's hit enter. And now it is going to look for a DHCP server. And once it finds the DHCP server, it is going to send DHCP offer packets to grab all the available addresses. Now while that is running, let's navigate to this status page and take a look at the LAN and which what active clients we currently have on. And as you can see, we have quite a few active clients with weird code names and spoof MAC addresses. Now the tool just completed. So now it's trying to knock off any host that is still available. This feature, from what I have tasted thus far, I have not seen the effects of it. But as a network administrator, you're probably wondering, but how do I protect myself from this? Well, Cisco has a feature in all their switches and routers called DHCP snooping. Let me just open up one of their websites here. This is an example of a guide on how to configure DHCP snooping. Now, DHCP snooping is a security feature that kind of acts as a firewall between your trusted and untrusted devices. Now a trusted device would be any device that you as a network administrator have complete control over that no end user will ever touch, such as routers or switches. And your untrusted device are devices that your end users are actually using. Now to learn more about DHCP snooping, I will have the two links of these two Cisco pages in the description. Thank you for watching this tutorial. And to see more tutorials and find out more information about us, please visit our website dot slash backtrack.com. Thanks so much and have a good day.